Hey Libras, God is Puff and this is your next 48 hours for April 21st to the 22nd of 2023. So before, right before I cut on your reading, I got the song Whip Appeal by Frank Ocean. So I'm going to write that down. You may want to look that up. So I feel like you could be, I don't know if you're going to the beach or you're just taking like a sports car on a, like a spin. You got the windows down. You're having a good time with somebody. All right, so uh, let's get started. This was an Oracle card message for Libra. Next 48 hours. I just see somebody's hair in the wind, whether you got hair or not. <laughs> I feel like you got the windows down, driving a car. It's a nice day. You're feeling really good in the next 48. Swan, Fidelity. It could be with someone that you have romantic feelings for or they have romantic feelings for you. I feel like you're going to realize that in the next 48. <laughs> You may not have noticed it because the overall energy is seal vulnerability. You may realize that someone likes you and it may catch you off guard. By the way, someone's looking at you, wasp, revenge. Someone may be jealous because of a relationship you have or because someone has feelings for you or a crush on you, toe of fortune. Someone feels like you're too lucky. You, Someone feels like you get everything you want and they're upset. Yeah, someone wants revenge against like a relationship you have or the fact that someone has feelings for you. It could have been a relationship you had too with someone that you're not even with anymore, but that person still loves you or they take care of you still or something like that. Because with Toad Fortune, someone feels like you're so lucky and you get whatever you want and you're spoiled and someone's upset. They're like Libra gets the love they want, the money they want, and, and it's making you uncomfortable. Someone gets mad because of the way someone loves you. Even if, like say for instance, you... um. Your spouse could have passed away and y'all had a very loving relationship. And this person is still mad because you experienced love. Someone's just mad about something you had. Either it's love or it's money or both. And you're realizing that someone's jealous or that you feel uncomfortable speaking about these things because someone gets so bitter around you about it. I just see you enjoying your life, having a good time. And then you realize that someone around you is getting angry or tense because of something and it's making you uncomfortable because you're realizing it it's catching you off guard we have the devil capricorn six of cups could be someone from your past or someone you have children with this could be a sibling someone from your childhood it could be a capricorn nine of cups wish fulfillment Four cups. Yeah, someone feels like you have the life that they want. I also feel like there's someone from your past or someone you have children with who is very much obsessed. Overall, it's the Emperor Aries. It could be an Aries or a father figure or someone older than you. Maybe you were the favorite child or the favorite child or a sibling or whatever. But um, yeah, someone from your past is obsessed with you. They see you as wish fulfillment. But you don't see it or you're not interested. And it's going to catch you off guard. There's also with Wasp Revenge. Someone may be mad because you married someone else or had kids with someone else. And then there's someone here who's just jealous. Because of the way um, other people love you. <laughs> Someone's jealous about that. You got all these people mad, <laughs> Libra. What did you do? I don't feel like you even did anything. You just exist. How are they mad at you because of how... Someone's literally mad at you because of how other people feel about you. How, because of how other people love you. Someone's mad at you. I gotta write that down. Yeah, because sometimes people don't even want they're it's like people can simply just be jealous because other people like you or love you. That person may not even genuinely want to be you. They just want the attention and love that you receive. 
clarifying the devil is the four swords. So this is someone you have blocked anyway. It could have been, again, someone that you had kids with or an ex or a father figure or someone that you blocked. Someone that you deem as toxic or there was a codependent relationship or this person just simply obsessed in love with you. You could have blocked this person. Two of Pentacles. Maybe they're a cheater. They're just toxic and you blocked them. Clarifying the Six of Cups is the Two of Cups. Or maybe this, this is fear that you are blocking out as well. Four of Wands. Someone wants to marry you and have kids with you. Someone is in love with you. With the Six of Cups, that's soulmate energy. Two of Cups. Could be children, like I said. The Four of Wands. Marriage, a home, union. Someone really, really wants this with you. The Lovers. Clarifying the Nine of Cups. Gemini, the Choice. The Moon card. Yeah, they secretly want this <laughs> you're about to be shocked yeah with seal vulnerability someone's just gonna spill it clarifying the four of cups is the three of wands so something you didn't see an amazing opportunity that you didn't even see with toe fortune is coming knight of swords and someone is oh someone may even propose but someone is spilling the tea queen of swords and there's someone who's very jealous of this. Overall energy with the Queen of Swords. There you are. Then we have the Emperor. Yeah, so I feel like you have a jealous ex or an obsessed ex. You got this Emperor here who loves you and is about to confess their feelings for you. And then you got this hating ass person who could be a sibling or friend or whoever who's jealous of how other people want you. They're jealous that your, your ex is obsessed or that someone's obsessed with you and they're jealous that you have new love. This person's just jealous. And you just sitting there like, what the hell am I supposed to do <laughs> about all this? Because like, it's not your fault. You can't help how other people feel about you. Afraid. Identity, survival, the opinion of others. Definitely don't worry about that. Ghost, memories will haunt you, unfinished business. Yeah. <laughs> Mushrooms, quiet growth, the hidden peace. That's all you want. <laughs> Overall energy is apple, the senses, hunger, sex. It's a lot of, a lot going on. But I feel like you just want to be peaceful, left alone. You're, you're going to be fine. But there is a lot going on. <laughs> I'm going to leave it there. I send you peace, blessings. Oh, also... With the quiet growth hidden in peace, I feel like if you don't want anyone involved in this situation, I would keep quiet and not feed into or respond to anyone. But I do feel there is someone here that you do have mutual feelings for. And if you do decide to take the relationship to the next level with that person, keep it to yourself. Don't share with friends. Don't share with anyone. Because with the quiet, with quiet growth, the hidden in peace, I feel like you need to keep this love offer to yourself. Because the nine of cups is wish fulfillment. Gemini with the lovers, the choice, the moon. Keep the choice you make in love a secret. Because that's going to cause someone to go into a jealous, vengeful rage. All right. I'm going to leave it there. I send you peace, blessings, and love. Namaste.